Located six miles west of Spencer, Iowa, Wisdom Station is Cornbelt Power Cooperative's only wholly owned power plant. With a capacity of 38 megawatts, Wisdom Unit 1 operates on a mixture of bituminous coal from Illinois and Indiana and subbituminous coal from the Wyoming Powder River Basin. In June of 1954, the Cornbelt Power Board of Directors approved the construction of Wisdom Unit 1 to add power supply to meet member cooperatives' growing demand. Named after Cornbell Power's longtime attorney, the Earl F. Wisdom Generating Station cost $7 million to build and came online in 1960. At that time, the plant had one of the largest generators of any coal plant in the state of Iowa. Today, the plant employs 18 full-time workers and operates mostly during times of hot or cold weather conditions. With a history of high availability, the plant has been an intermediate source of power. Current low market prices have recently reduced its operating time. Five control operators and five shift operators work 12-hour shifts to fully staff operation of the plant. Continual maintenance of the facility keeps the unit ready to operate whenever it's called upon. During plant operation, employees continually check on all equipment and processes to keep the unit operating safely and efficiently. See, it's coal's being burnt, coming out of the burner there, and that's where we're producing our heat. There's suction on it, and we need suction on the boiler to keep everything inside, the fuel inside, so it'll get in induced draft out the roof. Otherwise, if there's positive pressure on it, we'll have fuel blown out of these every little open crack in the plant, so, which is not safe. Shift operator Rod Steffes describes the process of moving bottom ash out of the boiler. He'll start out with it, the front doors closed and get all he can out of it just letting the gravity do its work. And then eventually he'll open the front doors and use this long pole and just kind of rake the rest of it out. But this will go down through these grinders, these two rollers right on the bottom. If it's big and heavy it'll get ground up and then sucked out of the bottom and end up in our ash silo. And it's going to be very hot. You're going to see the inside of the boiler right here when you look up and in. The coal we have today we, and the low level we're carrying, that's a very small amount of bottom ash. It's, it's just repeated the same process that he did here in four different locations across the bottom of the boiler. The bottom ash that we just removed here will go in the top of this silo, which is about seven stories up and be dropped in the top and just stored there until we later haul it across and put it in a landfill. Wisdom Unit 2, an 80 megawatt combustion turbine that came online in 2004, is located next to Wisdom Unit 1. Jointly owned by Basin Electric Power Cooperative, Wisdom Unit 2 can run on either natural gas or fuel oil. Employees from Unit 1 also operate Unit 2. Wisdom Unit 2 has the option to be converted to a combined cycle unit that could serve as a source of steam for Wisdom Unit 1.